New at noon today, Governor Janet Mills has vetoed a bill that would have given Wabanaki nations access to certain federal benefits. Since the Maine Indian Land Claims Settlement Act was passed more than 40 years ago, tribes have had to be specifically written into federal laws in order to receive benefits. In a statement today, Governor Mills said that though she didn't want to see the Wabanaki treated unfairly, this legislation had flaws that would lead to confusion and lawsuits. We spoke with the tribal ambassador for the Penobscot Nation last week who said this bill would have allowed Maine's tribes to be on the same playing field as the nation's other federally recognized tribes. Since the Settlement Act, all of the federal legislation that's been passed that we either have been uh, blocked from having access to or it's been unclear if we could access it, to have that lifted, that burden, and be able to really enjoy our rights as federally recognized tribes, that's a really big deal for the tribes. Governor Mills went on to say she is willing to work with the state's congressional delegation and the tribes to get the two most cited laws, the Stafford Disaster Relief and Emergency Assistance Act and the Indian Health Care Improvement Act uh, applicable to the Wabanaki. The bill had passed with enough votes, by the way, so that lawmakers have the option to override the governor's veto if they choose.